right now at noon. Well-deserved raises for the people who help teach your children critical life skills. Atlanta Public Schools teachers getting their first raise in years. Atlanta News First, Asia Wilson is live outside APS headquarters. So, Asia, this is connected to the district budget that was recently approved. What do you know about it? Yeah, you're exactly right. This is the largest teacher pay raise since 2009. And look, they already have signs posted around the district office. So certainly a big deal. District-wide teacher pay will increase 11% and staff across the district will get a 3 to 5% cost of living adjustment. Additionally, $11.8 million have been allocated for the superintendent's reader and learners initiative. It's where teachers will be able to take a professional development course that will help them in the classroom and then they receive a stipend for it. Also, the district has invested $9 million for special education teachers and support services, which we're told this is one of the district's greatest needs. Overall, we're told with this new increase, teachers starting pay is around $61,000, which is one of the highest in the metro and pay for teachers who've been in the district for decades is even higher. So our range, some teachers will be making six figures, which is awesome because they deserve it after decades of being with the district. Officials say this is something they've been working on for a while now and it's become a top priority, adding that they are committed to providing competitive salaries that will allow teachers to better feed their families while helping the district retain their workforce. The goal is to ensure that we retain and develop our teachers so they will stick with us. They won't leave and move the district to district because they're trying to make ends meet as a teacher or a professional. And so those raises and the budget allocation to the programming and the support help us retain our staff, help us keep the best. Back out here live, you're looking at some of the signs that they have here at the district office. There's more good news. I'm told the district has also made upgrades to their dress code policy and adopted a crown policy to make sure everyone feels welcome, even down to their hair. We're live in downtown Atlanta. Asia Wilson, Atlanta News First. Thank you, Asia.